What's up, YouTube? It's Courtney Truman Steamers. Um, I'm over here doing a church that I always do. I always do the uh, town hall where they have like a lot of parties and events, you know, the carpet. Uh, but I'm over here doing the pews today, August the 8th. Um, main concern for cleaning them, as you can see, you got like some kind of wet, sticky product on, you know, some of the pews. But we're going to go ahead and do all of them today. I'm doing all the pews. Uh, plus the ones up there I'm doing a total of today of seven hundred dollars. Uh, I actually got two commercial jobs today So this one here is seven hundred and then my next commercial job is uh, carpet clean. It's a three hundred dollar job So that's a good day today two jobs a um, thousand uh, dollars um, And I have to go back and do a um, Look at a customer's carpet. I cleaned a couple weeks ago uh, got some wicking issues going on, so I probably just, you know, he sent me some pictures, so it's just something just probably either go back and do a, a end cap on it or um, just probably spray some proxy on it. But I always want to make sure the customers are happy. So, again, this is what I'm doing today. Uh, right now, I'm just spraying on especially the wax areas, um, get those, help start breaking those down. Got my truck mount war warming up. Didn't work yesterday. Yesterday was my birthday, so just chilled out. Didn't do much. I'm not really a party person. Uh, really just stayed at the house, and uh, me and my wife. And uh, that's how I enjoyed my birthday on the Monday. And um, actually, it was a good day because the kids went back to school. So it was a good birthday present. Get the kids out the house. Uh, so, all right, guys. So let's show you what I'm doing on these pews. Again, guys, I'm really just focusing on those those little areas right there some kind of wax but again it's not i mean it's going to fall right off especially when i uh, uh oh hit it with the extraction got a few right there yeah i think this job will probably take me about i'm looking at maybe two hours maybe two and a half at the most and then I got my buffer with me so I can do uh, my next job is going to be a uh, uh, end cap, but I'm going to use my 175. Yep, you know, the pews are kind of tight. Okay, I think I've already sprayed. Yeah, I already sprayed those. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, finish spraying these down so this solution can sit on those trouble areas, start helping, you know, soften those areas up, make it easier to clean, and I will see the afterward. day to day all right guys i am done these pews came out amazing and like i said they were just really concerned about the um the little wax particles that were on the pews i don't know where it came from they're like some kind of cleaning agent that someone probably tried to use but you can see all came up good once everything's fully dry it's going to be all even and nice smelling good Got a good uh, detergent going through my rinse, which has a nice fragrance on it. Remember how all that wax buildup was on them? And again, right now, you just see the areas where it's a little wetter than other parts, but once it fully dries. And this upholstery right here really doesn't take that long to dry anyway. As you can see, no water on my hand. 
So, uh, but yeah, it came out great. Quick 700 bucks. What time did I get here? I think I got here around 10.15. Probably started about 10.45. And here it is. It's uh, 12 o'clock, so that's not bad. Um, and um, got another job after this, which is another commercial job. <clears throat> Yep, you know, um, see, right here, so this is the job I'm doing now for 700 church seating, and then my next one's 300, and then I got a three-roomer. I want to let one of my buddies do that for me, because I think these two jobs are, you know, that's, that's my daily goal anyways, $1,000, so two jobs, and then like I said, I have to go back and um, um, redo some areas that went back on a customer's carpets um, after my second job. So it's a pretty good day today. And that's gonna do it guys. So shear dry, did very well. You know, once that hot that hot um water hit it, I mean it just melted off with no problems. And it, and again you guys see that I pre-treated it with the uh encapsulation cleaner from Bunnet Pro. Um so again, everything came out well. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish wrapping it up. Again, not bad for a couple hours, 700 bucks. And again, I've all, and another thing too, guys, I always do um, the church hall where they have like events and parties. Uh, the guy who runs the church, he's been asking me for like over a year about these pews, and they had the same problem for over a year. And um, he kept asking me, well, can you do it for 500? And every time he asked me, I would say no. Well, like three months ago, he was like, well, I'll tell you what, Courtney, you give me your lowest price. And, and I kept telling him 700 for over a year. Um, so he said, well, you give me your lowest price and you think about it. I mean, guys, there's nothing to think about. So he asked me again and I said, 700. And you can see guys, he finally, you know, let me do it. I mean, when these customers know that you do good work and they get a good feel for you. I mean, this guy's had me at his house, his son's house. Again, I do the church like three, four times a year. I mean, you know, Sometimes they'll try to use that as their advantage to try to, you know, take advantage of you by lowering the price. But guys, never give in. I mean, unless you just want to do it or if you really, really need the funds, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. But again, I'm not desperate for money. And again, I like to, you know, stand my ground when it comes to my prices. Uh, I've had two customers already this week counsel because of prices, because they said they found someone cheaper. And again, I'm not going to go chase them because they found someone cheaper because, anything in life services or products we always find it cheaper so you know I, i'd really just go for what, what i think i'm worth and also the customers that really want to use me um and it's not gonna you know make or break me so but that's gonna do it uh, just a little tip of the day also um stay in your ground when it comes to your prices and uh, that way customers will take you more serious all right guys it's courtney Truman steamers um uh, go ahead and finish Wrapping up, get these hoses wrapped up. Get this put up. <clears throat> yep, this around, extra strength. And it's gonna do it. Rain has slowed down. Nah, uh, thanks again, guys, for watching. About to go do some bunny cleaning now, and I'll see you guys in the next video.